And not only do I treat my body like a temple shawl, I treat my body like the Catholic Church, full of bread, wine, and the constant urge to worship a man in a loincloth. <laughs> Best of luck, pal. An amazing time out there. So it's fun. all yours. On to the star. Now, yeah. yeah, go for yeah. it. Have fun, mate. Enjoy. Hello. Hello, how are you? Uh, I'm good. Let's start with your name, please. Uh, my name's Liam Bannigan. Well, nice to meet you. Thank you. So, where are you from? Uh, I'm from Essex. Uh, 25. And what do you do, Liam? Uh, I work with my dad as a plumber. OK. How long have you been doing that for? Uh, for about two and a half years. All right, Liam, good luck. Thank you very much. <laughs> OK, guys, so I want to start off real quick by saying that I'm a gay man. Sorry, ladies. No, but I do feel the need to say that, though, as a lot of people seem to mistake me for a lesbian. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, apparently the man boobs kind of throw people off a little bit. <laughs> yeah, but say what you want about the man boobs, there is no greater feeling in life than getting home after a long day of work and just whipping off that bra. <laughs> Am I right? Simon, you know what I'm talking about. I'm so with you. <laughs> uh, but, guys, when I'm not being a lesbian, um, <laughs> I actually work with my dad as a plumber, as I said, and uh, safe to say that we don't get along. I think it's obvious. Um, so, basically, my dad, he never trusts me while we're there. He never does. Like, he'll ask me to go to the van to get a hammer, for example, but he'd go into full detail of what a hammer is. <laughs> Like, I think he thinks I'm going to go to the van and, I don't know, come back in, like, a bright pink ball gown. <laughs> <laughs> and be like, Dad, <laughs> the craziest thing happened. <laughs> Madonna was there, it was the whole thing. You won't believe it. <laughs> we do argue a lot at work as well. So as a way of getting, like, my secret revenge, I've decided to treat everything on a building site like a West End performance. <laughs> goes down the hoot, as you can imagine. So, an example of this, right, my dad, he chews gum all day at work. Like, so loud, right? So, what I do now, I grab the screw gun, I go up to him and I go, you pop that gum one more time. <laughs> he had it coming. He had it coming. He only had himself to play. <laughs> and don't be afraid to add in a bit of a kickball change, you know, some shimmy shimmies. <laughs> think of the steps, ladies. Woo! <laughs> I could probably think of the steps a little bit more in life, not gonna lie to you. I am trying to lose a bit of weight, guys. I feel like it's the mature thing to do since I'm failing miserably at being an adult. My mum's words, not mine. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm still splitting my lips and shoving in too many Pringles. <laughs> I'm constantly getting my hand stuck in the Pringles can, which is, like, not a good look. <laughs> but my brother as well, he's always on at me about losing weight. You know, he's like, Liam, you know, you should treat your body like a temple. And not only do I treat my body like a temple, Sean, I treat my body like the Catholic Church, full of bread, wine, and the constant urge to worship a man in a loincloth. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys so much. Thank you. Very good. David, you're on your feet. Well, I feel like we're at the birth of something really special here because what I loved about that was how authentic it was, how authentic it was to you. <laughs> you're super likeable. You're obviously naturally funny. I mean, I, I just think you're going to go super, super far, so I'm really, really excited for you from, from that audition. Thank you. <laughs>
To the big audience, they were on your side the whole time. Everyone was willing you to do well. And like David said, it was so authentic. I could listen to the Essex banter all <laughs> night. <laughs> it is, yes, exactly. Get that Lambrino. <laughs> <laughs> it's exactly that. The more you Thank are yourself, you. the more we love you. So well yeah. done. Well exactly. Done. You didn't turn into a different person. It, it felt very relaxed. I think you did really well. It was inventive. It was natural. It was funny. And I can't, I can't wait to see you develop because I think you've got masses of potential. Thank you so much. Really good. I was going to ask you, Liam, so if you, if you were to make the final, have you got something in your head which is kind of more of a musical production in addition to what you do? Uh, yeah, shockingly, yes. Yes. <laughs> Wait, no, you're very funny, very original. Uh, I think I know where this is going to go. Let's start with David. Let me kick this off, Liam, with a yes. <laughs> Thank you so much. Alicia. It's a yes from me, Liam. Amanda. It's a yes from me. Another one that counts. Liam, you've got four yeses. <laughs> Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. Thank you.